Hello and welcome! In this video, I'm going to be playing Brutal Doom Hell on Earth Starter Pack. This is the first Brutal Doom mod that I ever downloaded. And this was an... Uh, this was an easy to use mod. Like, everything was configured, everything was uh, optimized. You just... You just fucking install it and play. Like, the... It, it was quite convenient that I found this particular one to start out with. And to this day, this is still my favorite Doom mod. The, this one is fantastic. The, in my personal opinion, this one is better than any other one that I have played. Like, the, this one is unfucking real uh, So we're just gonna jump in here. You know, I've been doing a lot of Doom mods lately. I've, I've played a lot of them. You know, it's Halloween time. Halloween's in about a week, and I, I... I I don't know, I've owned this game for maybe three years, and I... This is just a good one to play around this time of the year. Like, th this is fantastic. Get my bearings here. Now, one thing to notice right off the bat, these graphics are lush and beautiful. Like, these are fantastic graphics. I'm not good at optimizing shit. You know, like, a lot of the Doom mods... It requires some technique that I don't currently have. You know, I'm learning, but... I mean, this this one's set up and ready to go. Like, th this was just fantastic. The first time I found this, I could not put it down. Like, I just, I just kept going. I completely binged on it for a couple days. I think I've played through this maybe twice? I'm not sure. And I have played other Doom mods that were fantastic. But never quite this good. The level design... Everything's perfect. This is a perfect storm. An absolute perfect fucking storm. The level of detail on this is so unbelievable. Like, this is Doom. To me, this is fucking Doom. People like those new Dooms, and I've stated it repeatedly. I don't really care for them that much. And I'm a Doom fanatic. Like, I am obsessed with Doom. There's a few game series that I'm obsessed with, and Doom is one of them. And to this day, I still can't get into those modern ones. Uh, being the last two to come out. I own them multiple times, and I keep trying them, and I hope one day I'll end up liking them. I'm out of ammo. That's not good. Yeah, but currently I just, I can't get into them. <clears throat> and 
and again, I, I've stated this on several different videos, but I, I don't want to punch anything. You know, like, I, I'm not... I, I got a gun here. I use guns to kill demons. I, I'm not... I'm not looking to punch them or do uh, fatalities on them. And which this game has some of that too, but I, I don't ever use it. I don't care. Uh, it's not for me. I hate it hated the ammo cap in the new games you get you get a piss amount of ammo there's not enough guns you're constantly having to heal it's I don't know it doesn't have the same feel to me now Doom 3 still had the same feel to me uh, Doom 3's level design in my opinion really sucked ass like it was it was crap but for the time, the graphics were absolutely legendary, and it was a fun general game to play through. I played through it once. Now, these new Doom games, again, they are graphically beautiful, but as far as gameplay-wise, I... I haven't, uh... I haven't liked them too much. Who you little fucker? Almost died there. Takes a while to get used to the controls. Now, I am using an Xbox One controller. Again, for Doom games, I prefer a controller. I did not start out with the PC Doom. The first Doom that I played was on Super Nintendo. And then Sega Saturn. And then 32X. And then Atari Jaguar. And then Xbox 360 with the, you know, the re-released version that were, uh, you had both thumbsticks to use, and I, I fell in love with that, and I never really got over that. You know, teach their own, and I can use the keyboard and mouse, but it's just not as precise for me. You know, like the, uh, I always, I always state, you know, when it comes to the keyboard and mouse, I can't use my magic thumbs. You know, the, these are these are highly tuned thumbs that I have uh, been tuning for 37 years or some fucking shit. And with the keyboard and mouse, it becomes useless. Also, I'd like to point out the gore, because it is beautiful. Look at all this. Look at this fucking brain matter and teeth and... Ugh. It's just... It's fucking beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful graphics. God damn it, do I love pixels. Started to drool a little bit there. I gotta calm myself down. Can't be drooling. Attention, all marine units. This is command. Give it a save here. We are barricaded on the command center. We are trying to send distress signals to Earth. If anyone out there is still alive, we're en route to our position. We have ammo and food. Godspeed. 
You hear what that man said? There's even a little bit of fucking storyline in this mod. Like, that that's impressive as shit. Yeah, the, uh... The Mars military station has been attacked by demons. And the Marines are trying to regroup. Now, I don't know which version it was. I want to say it was Super Nintendo that started out with an actual storyline. It wasn't much, but it was like... It was just like one little, one little page of uh, dialogue. And it was... Uh, I think the story went like... You, you and, uh, I don't know, you and a team went to go explore what had happened on the Mars base, and you waited by the vehicle while your comrades went in there, and then all you heard was, uh, people dying, and then you went in. I don't know why you'd be watching the vehicle or some shit, but I don't, I don't know what version I read that on. I'd have to actually, uh, look that up, but... It was young, so I'm gonna say it's when I. It was either fucking Super Nintendo or Sega Saturn, I think. I don't know, but it was awesome. You don't gotta have much storyline, but it helps when you have a little bit. I don't know, like, I remember back in the days of, uh, PlayStation and Sega Saturn, you know? Shit. The, the story would get you all hyped up for the fucking game. You know, you'd have your video cutscene in the beginning or whatever, usually five minutes long or whatever, and then, like, it'd get you all hyped up for the game, and then you'd be like, yeah, fucking play this shit. I miss that. Either it's non-existent, or the game will go on for 20 fucking minutes before you can start, which I, I can't stand either. You make it short and sweet. Short and sweet is key. Shotgun shells. I don't even know what the fuck I'm doing out here. I need to get a key first. What the fuck? Definitely been a while since I played this. I'm just a barrel, too. Don't remember. I don't know how many times I've tried to play those new Doom games, though.
and I could almost kind of get into the second one. Like, I started getting into it a little bit, and then I lost interest. I just keep trying to force myself. Now, when the uh, re-release of Doom 64 came out, I was all over that shit. I played that beginning to end, you know, purchased it day one. Love it. Got it for, you know, several different platforms again. I. Oh, just the beauty. The beauty of Doom gets to me a lot. Now I don't got no fucking... This is the beginning of the level. Or is it? What? I don't fucking know what's going on. What am I missing? Oh, I opened up something there. Pay no attention to me, I've gone tarted. That is a red key. There we go. I don't think it's possible for me to say enough good things about this mod. Whoever the fuck was responsible for this, bravo. Because you are a fucking legend. Trying to put the guts back in his stomach. Love it. And I did it again. Keep slipping on that blood. Mm. Little horse shit ass. There we go, I got my green shit. Now, being the month of October, all I've been doing is watching horror movies and playing horror-related games and eating candy. Which, this year, I purchased... And I ended up weighing it. It was 11 pounds of candy. Chocolate, you know. Now, I want to point out that I live at a dead end. We get about, uh, I don't know, two trick-or-treaters per year. I just put a big bowl of candy out there and I 
leave a note saying take as much as you want. You know, my, my thought press on it, blah, 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 my thought process on it is any little kids got the guts to come to my house, he deserves a lot of candy. I'm a little bit of a hermit. I didn't pick the name Bunker Gamer 82 because I thought it sounded cool. I'm, uh, I wouldn't consider myself crazy. Maybe I'm semi crazy. But, uh, I live pretty isolated. You know, I got more video games and guns than Jesus. And, you know, I just, uh, I keep to myself. People don't bother me, I don't bother people. I'm probably the only person in the area, too, that has a trespassers will be shot sign. Which, it's nice, you know, like, ever since I put up that sign, don't get any more people turning around in the, uh, driveway. Don't get any solicitation. You know, the, uh, the Mormons definitely don't step foot on the property anymore. It, it's, it's nice. I would suggest it. You know, if you're tired of getting bothered, make yourself a sign. You know, make a sign. Don't buy a sign. Just get yourself a plaque of wood and uh, uh, write on it with black paint. Trespassers will be shot. And I guarantee you won't be bothered anymore. And I also have a trespassers uh, will be eaten sign. And then I got a little, little smiley face after it. I think that's pretty effective too. Though I don't think my neighbors like me very much. You know, I, we, we had uh, we had the new neighbors move in eh, maybe three, four years ago. I, you know, I, I said hi to the husband like once. That, that's, that, that's pretty much all the communication. I don't know, where am I going? I got a fucking... I'm all blabbering on. I forgot where the shit I'm going. I got a damn key, man. Is it this key? It isn't. Where are the keys? I don't see the keys on the screen. I... What the fuck? You little bastard. Where'd you come from? That man was a little bastard. Holy shit! That ain't no good. He done tore my head off. Talking about my isolated cabin in the woods and uh... I done got killed. Anyone out there is still alive, but I'm to our position. Ammo and
be, I might be a little crazy. Semi-crazy, we'll go with. You know, in the rumor I always heard, truly insane people will deny up and down that they're crazy. Like, truly crazy people have no idea that they're crazy. That's why they're crazy. I'm just sucking it up. You know what? Oh, farts. I didn't want to do that. Wanted to do a new game. <laughs> Whoops. All right. Let's do Behind Hellish Lines. That's the one I've played the least. This is the third episode where you enter Hell. That's so pretty. Fell in the fire. I melted. Had a shit smacker behind me. Damn shit smackers. Whoa. 
Well, that tactic didn't work. I could use me an RPG about now. I don't know if there's anything better than Doom. At least when it comes to shooters, I don't... Oh, fuck ass! Last cocksucking bastard! Oh, shit. You little cocksucking bastard. I fell in that fucking fire again. I can manage not to fall in the fucking fire. I think we'll save it there. Uh, uh. 
have been killed. That's my corpse right there. Absolutely beautiful. I'm in love with Doom's graphics, like original Doom. I, that's an imp right there. That is what an imp looks like. That's what a dead marine looks like. Like, th this is what these look like. In the new Doom games, you know, like, I, again, I don't, uh... Of course, I'm not a graphic hound either. I, I have always said over and over, I don't give a shit about the graphics. It's the gameplay. But, you know, like, it's... I am particular to pixel-based graphics. That little candle right there, that's fucking beautiful. That is a beautiful fucking candle. Not to say I don't like modern graphics either. You, you give me the you give me the most high end graphics, you know, and I'll be enjoying them. But I also enjoy this, you know, like I enjoy Demon Attack for Atari Twenty Six Hundred. I think it looks beautiful. Uh, I enjoy uh, a plethora of Nintendo Entertainment System games. I still think they look beautiful to this day, especially with HD graphics. Gorgeous. Yeah, Super Nintendo. Fucking Sega 32X. They all have their own unique style of graphics. I, I can appreciate all graphics. You know the funny thing about Doom? I still remember this as a kid. I didn't hear anything about Doom. Until the Christian community was up in arms about it. And then it blew up. Like it was everywhere. Everybody was talking about Doom. <coughs> if the Christian community didn't have such an outrage against this game, I wonder if it would have been as big as it was. It's just funny that they essentially helped to promote this game, unwillingly. You know, that's the exact opposite that they wanted. Sometimes it's best just to keep your mouth shut. Nothing else up here, huh? They are pretty stingy with the goodies around here. Even got a fucking shotgun. Get the fuck out of my way. 
goddamn severed heads. Well, shit. Let's go into battle for Los Angeles a little bit. Now, I remember this first level is a bitch. And it is a bitch because it's, uh, I don't know, it confuses me. It confuses me every time I play it. I get turned around and then I don't know where the fuck I'm going. Wow. That is probably the fastest I have ever found that key card in my life. So there's the city off yonder. That's LA. Which I hear nobody escapes LA. I had a friend move to L.A. once. And I never heard from him again. Dead man hanging up there. So the thing with this map is, uh, as soon as I hit this switch, there's gonna be fucking demons all over the damn place. Demon Central. are a pain in the ass. Alright. Fuck you. 
pick up those cocksuckers. Love that blue blood. So cool looking. Man, I love the shotgun. Fucker. Bastard. Whoa. He done ate my giblets. Ate them right up. Whoa, farts. Didn't I get a fucking rocket launcher? Or grenade launcher? RPG? No RPG, huh? I must have missed it.
Ooh. Now, I very much like me a double barrel sawed off. Blah, blah, blah. Double barrel sawed off. Them's is nice corn. Uh, a, a gun introduced in the original Doom 2. Very, very nice. I don't know where the fuck I'm going. I'm going somewhere. Sorry, my dog was hacking. Making sure he wasn't choking or something. There's the RPG. The question is, where the fuck am I going? I've gone for yeah. Yeah, that's the ticket. That's where the fucking eggs be. This guy's jerking off. Yeah, we'll let them fight. You know, I'd love to see a Doom mod where I could be, like, I could pick from all these enemies and, like, verse a bunch of Marines. I think that'd be cool as shit. And, you know, you'd go around with other demons, too, obviously. It'd be like a group of demons, you know, it'd be like when they're, when they're attacking the Marines. That, that's a mod I, I haven't seen yet. That would be cool as shit. You know, I want to be a fucking imp. I want to be a dead marine, you know. I want to be a fucking pinky. Oh shit. Macaroni.
fuck, man? Am I missing? There's just a bunch of them. Oh, shit. Oh, there was a bunch of them. Or, I shouldn't say a bunch, maybe three or four. This game's got some crazy boss fights, too. I remember that shit. Absolutely nuts. Gotta get this guy off the machine gun. Got him. In which you can use this too. How do you do it? Ah. That's fucking firepower right there. Double barrel is not good for outdoors. Close quarters, absolutely. Love that green and uh, blue glow. Fucking gorgeous. Mm. Eh. Well, that ain't a good start. A little bit of platform in here. To get the blue key card <clears throat> shit
Whoo! I always hated that. Oh, here they come. Aunt Jemima's pancakes. Tell me this game ain't fucking optimized. Oh fuck! Run! Fuck! <sighs> I love this game. Yeah, all that shit and I don't get no slowdown, and then some of these other Doom mods I'm playing, I'm getting slowdown when there's fucking four people on the screen. I can't figure it out. You know, and again, I, I'm I'm an amateur with mods. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. So, obviously, I'm doing certain shit wrong. But this plays wonderfully. This, this, this fucking uh, mod is my favorite Doom game, period, I believe. I like this more than any Doom game I've ever played. Like, th this is fantastic. Again, the person responsible for this, holy shit. Some type of fucking uh, game wizard made this in his magical laboratory or some fucking shit. Because this is insane. I would definitely check out Brutal Doom... Uh, what the fuck is it called? Whatever the hell I said in the beginning. Uh, Hell's Starter Pack or some fucking shit. Something like that. Whatever. But anyway, thank you so much for watching. Please, like and subscribe and make sure to have yourselves a great day.